if you have not seen the school bus in the US that is a school bus that's coming in the morning to pick up school uh, pick up kids in this locality uh, so there are certain rules that you have to follow when you are driving next to the school bus okay so when it is stopped there will be a stop sign that uh, will be put next to the board when i get closer i'll show you where it is so you cannot uh, cross and also there will be signs uh that will show that when you are in the school zone and during the posted time you cannot go more than 20 or 25 i don't remember 20 uh, yeah 20 is the speed limit so all of the all of them will slow down even if you are driving on the other side of the road because uh kids can cross the road and uh, they'll get hurt so that's the only reason they have posted and the fines are not so uh low the you will be you will be heavily fined when you violate all of the laws or rules around uh, driving next to the school bus so the school bus is mostly colored yellow and uh, mostly this is the so you can identify a school bus easily so do you see the stop sign that i am talking about he can um extend that board so then you'll have to stop behind the school bus so this is the frisco school district isd here the schools are uh, free uh, public schools just that uh, you have to be in the uh, you, your home has to be in the school district for your kids to go to that school it doesn't need anything else and the home prices are based on uh, the school district <laughs> in india it's a different situation you could live anywhere and send your schools to anywhere else in the world but here uh, the thing is different all right so you now saw how the school bus looks like it's trying to get a kid from that home <laughs> all right friends